We have finished. Now we are going to start with. Good morning, all of you. Good morning, Beth. So we all is over. We finished last week. Now the second one is taking up is going to be nylon. Let's talk about it. Start reading. Okay, I read. Okay, Beth. Dialogue is the another made with fiber. In 1931, it was made without using any natural raw material from plants or animals. It was prepared from a coal, water, and air. It was the first fully synthetic fiber. Adjust the mic, Beta. Adjust the mic so that the noise is. So the second fiber that we are going to work on is nylon. It's a man-made fiber. Remember that this is the only fiber which did not come from natural raw material. Maybe it is plant or animal. It does not come from natural. Whereas remember, rayon we got it from wood pulp, so that was natural. But it is given the name as Man-made because man researched on it. You understood? Man researched on this, so it was known as man-made fiber. But the product or the raw material was from plant. That is the what is man? Yes, sir. In this case, this is hundred percent man-made because even the resources are not from nature. That is plant or animal. This was prepared in the laboratory. This was laboratory by using coal, water, and air. So it was completely man-made, synthetic, completely synthesized by or made. What is synthetic? Artificial. What is synthetic? Artificial. Totally made by human beings. Is it clear? Is it clear? Yes. Yes. More features of nylon. One by one. Okay, why is this going too slow? My voice. Now. Now is it okay? Yes. Hello. My uh, is is it the same problem with all of you? Regarding my voice. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Am I? Am I, am I, am I Am I audible? Yes, ma'am. Is my voice faint? No. Okay. Loud? No, ma'am. What no, ma'am? Is it okay? You are able to understand whatever I am saying? Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes. 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 Start reading, beta. It is a bag. It is the strongest synthetic plastic material which can be molded to any shape. It is strong and easy to dye. Nylon fibers do not absorb water easily. It is elastic in nature and has highly durable. Now, if we talk about how it is made, it is a polymer. That is a type of polymer. I told you that many monomers they join together, form a long chain with the process of polymerization, and we call it as a polymer. Very strong plastic material, and you can give it a shape, any type of shape you can give. Very strong, and it's very easy to color, easy to dye. But only disadvantage is that that these fibers they do not absorb water so easily, and you can pull it. Remember the nylon uh, wires; you can pull it. So it is elastic in nature, but it does not break. Remember that you can pull it, but it does not 
great. So it is highly durable. Any problem? No, ma'am. Okay. One by one, we are going to see the properties of nylon. The first one is what, Rita? Can anyone read? The first class material. Ah, uh, Rita, just a moment. Uh, let others also take up the chance. If you don't mind. Okay. Yes. Um, can I read? No, someone says no. elastic material. Toughest. Toughest elastic material. What is nylon? It is very, very tough. Tough. And there's elasticity, so you can pull it, so it is elastic material. Very tough, but it does not break. Remember that. What is this one? High tensile strength. High tensile strength. That means you can pull it. What is tensile strength? You can pull it. That is called tensile strength. Very high. It does not break. Next. Slightly water absorbent dries quickly. Okay. Now, if you wear a nylon cloth, for example, okay, we generally don't wear because it does not soak or it does not absorb the sweat. If it does not absorb the sweat, then we will have skin infection. Remember that. So, we generally do not allow, do not wear. Uh, the nylon cloth, mm -hmm. right, Rita? But what is this? Yes. It does not absorb sweat. But the plus point is that if you are washing it, it dries very fast. Yes. It can be molded into fibers, bend size, sheets, bristles, bristles sheets, roots, tubes, and coatings. Rods, whether or not roads. You said roads, the roads will be this. This is roads. Am I right? Yes. If the pronunciation changes, this is road. And what is this? Rod. You understood now? The way you pronounce the meaning changes. Be careful. Now you can give it a shape. What is the meaning of molding? You can give the shape into Fibers that is thread. You have seen toothbrush? Yes. The, with, the brush with which you brush your teeth, those are called as bristles. Then you have what sheets? Nylon sheets you have. Then you have got rods of nylon. You have got tubes, you have got coatings. So everything is made up of nylon. Nylon. Resids. Oil, grease, moat, fungus, and other pests. Pest. Now, oil cannot harm this uh, nylon. Grease also can. What is, what is grease? This is black oil. Remember that. Moth. Now, what is moth? It's an insect. So, if you've got a nylon clothes, this moth cannot make a hole in the nylon clothes. You know, so, it is resistant. Whereas in the cotton clothes or the woolen clothes, the insect can make a hole. They eat it. Remember that. Then also, uh, cotton clothes, you must have observed fungal infection, the black spots. Whereas, yes. nothing happens to the nylon clothes. And other pests, means other insects, they do not harm these fabric. So they are resistant to it. Yes. Can we? Can be made into plates or powder. This is pellets actually. Pellets. Press Small, small. Point like structure. These are called as pellets. Or you can powder it also. You can make it into fine powder also. This is the advantage. Next. What is it? Lustrous means shiny. What is the meaning of lustrous, beta? Shiny. Shiny. Glossy. Brilliant. That's the lustrous. And you know that nylon clothes you can easily, easily wash it. 
Over. Any problem? The properties of nylon? No. 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 It's the revision part. Types of synthetic fibers, please. Ma'am, can I read? Ms. Ba? Is that you, Ms. Ba? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Types of synthetic fibers. Nylon. Nylon fiber is strong, elastic and light. It was lustrous and easy to wash. So, it became very popular for making clothes. We use many articles made from nylon. Ms. Ba, I said something. I said be twice. Yes or no? Yes, ma'am. I said became twice. Why you did not stop? You are reading it is a past tense. See? It was. It is a past tense. Right? And you yes. say this is become. That, that is a wrong English. So I stopped you twice, but still you continue. Why did I? Sorry, ma'am. Thank you. You will not learn otherwise. Whenever I'm stopping you, you correct yourself. So your English becomes good. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. Don't feel sorry about it. But whenever I said became, became, became twice, but then also you continue. Don't do that. I want you to correct mm. yourself. Okay? Read it again. It was lustrous and easy to wash. So it became very popular for making clothes. We use many articles made from nylon, such as socks, ropes, tents, toothbrushes, car, car seat belts, sleeping bags, curtains, etc. Curtains. 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 Now, nylon fiber features very strong, as we have already learned on this, this elastic and very light. It was very shiny and it was very easy to wash as well. So it became popular. People started making clothes out of nylon. The articles that we make from nylon are socks, ropes, tents, brushes, toothbrushes, even the car seat belts are made up of nylon, sleeping bags. Curtains, that's called as draperies, that is also made up of nylon. Any problem? No, ma'am. See over here? These are curtains. Right? Yes. Yes. You see this? This is ropes. Socks. You see this? Socks. Yes. All these are made up of nylon. Now let's see if uses one by one. Ma'am, can I read? Ma'am, can I read? Yes, better. Nylon yes, is also me. used. Nylon is also used for making parachutes and ropes for Ropes, uh, ropes for rock climbing and nylon thread is actually stronger than a steel web, steel wire. Now, nylon we can see in making of parachutes, you know what are parachutes and for rock climbing, isn't it? For rock climbing, you need very strong ropes. So these ropes are made of nylon. Remember that this thread, the nylon thread is even stronger than a steel wire, can you just imagine, a metallic wire we are talking about. This nylon has got a very high tensile strength and can be used even in mountain climbing, rock climbing. Do you understand? Yes. This is parachute. This is rock climbing. Okay? Yes. Of nylon one by one. And can I read? 
Stretchable clothes that anyone can fit in. Yes. Any shape can fit in. That's not stretchable because uh, the stretchable. When you pull the jeans, you can stretch it. Yes. So nylons are added to it. Next. Mm, seat belts. Upholstery. 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 You decorate the offices, the seats with nylon clothes. Yes. Upholds to it. Next. Ropes. Next. Wheel thread. You know what is wheel thread? That you use for sewing yes. machine? Wheels we are yes. using for sewing machine. Next. Thread. Sleeping bags, swimming wears. The costumes when you go for uh, what do you call this? Swimming, swimming. Yeah, in the water yes. park, you wear the costume yeah. that is for swimming wear. Raincoats, track suits. Fishing net and fishing lines. Understood. You, you, uh, the fishermen take a huge net and throw it in the water body. Yes. That is fishing net. And fishing lines is the one person having a, a rod and then uh, he puts a bait in the uh, fishing rod. Yes, at the other end and puts it in the water yes. and wait for now till. A fish yes. comes for the bait. Yes, so he can take one fish at a time. Remember that. When it's in the fishing net, you can get thousands of fishes together. Clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. What is this one? Making saris. Okay. You got nine on saris, remember? Yes, yes. Now, Leon is over. Nylon is over. Is there any problem? No, ma'am. Now we are coming to polyester and acrylic. What are we coming to with Polyester and acrylic. And acrylic. And acrylic. Acrylic. Polyester. 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 Ma'am, can I read? Synthetic Who is fiber. Owen oh, Fatima. Ma'am, can I read? Let Oman Fatima read with her. Okay. Polyester is another synthetic fiber. Fabric made from the fiber does not get wrinkled easily. It remains crisp and it is easy to wash. So, it is, it is quite suitable for making dress material. You must have seen people wearing nice polyester shirts shirts and other dresses. Terilin. Terilin is a popular polyester. It can be drawn into very fine fiber that can be woven like any other yarn. Thank you. Now, other synthetic fiber that we are going to talk about is polyester. The best part is that Whenever we wear any clothes and they sit on a bench or on a gets crumpled, probably the clothes get wrinkled and crumpled. Do you agree or not? Yes. So yes. this this polyester, they don't get crumpled. They don't have any wrinkles. Okay, that's the plus point of the fabric. That is polyester. First point is that they don't get crumpled or wrinkled. It remains strict. It's like paper. It remains strict and you can wash it very easily. 
So people started making dress materials out of uh, polyester. People wear polyester shirts and dresses as well. The name of polyester that we are going to talk about is terrilin. What it is? It's a popular polyester terrilin that people use it. The best part is that you can pull it into fine fiber that is fine wires and also there's a reason that it can be woven like yarn. You know what is yarn? Out of that threads and then from the threads you can make yarn with clothes. You understand? Yes. Yes, yes ma'am. Ma Um, can I? Um, can I? Give your name, Bita. Sanya. Select M. Hey, Sanya, did you uh, go through it once? No, ma'am. Okay, then read it. Sanya, you need. The number of signature in India? My mother always buys pet bottles and pet jars for storing rice and sugar. I wonder what pet is. Continue. Continue with that. Pet is a very familiar form of polyester. It is used for making bottles, utensils, films, wires and many other useful products. Now, this pet bottles, even you must have uh, seen at home in the kitchen. It looks the same kind plastic bottles, it's not for see through bottles, for storing all the uh, grains, rather, sugar, tea, everything you can put. So, you can see what is inside there. So, pet is a type of polyester. We make bottles, utensils. The vessels, the films, the wires, and other useful products from from the plastics. That is acrylic. Yes. Yes, Vita. Still here? Yes. Yes, yes ma'am. Read. Ma'am, can I? So let her read, Vita. After what? What's your name? No, the other one? Sanya. Huh? Yes? Please continue with the Maria. Hello? Can anyone yes, start this? Yeah, Miriam, start. Ma'am, can I? Can I? Let Madhya continue. If there's any problem, then you will start. We wear? We wear sweaters and use shawls or blankets in the winter. Many of these actually not made from natural wool. Through they appear or resemble wool. Resemble wool. Yes. These are prepared from another type of synthetic fiber called acry acrylic. Acrylic. The wool wool optic Say with me. acrylic. Acrylic. The wool optic ac acrylic. The wool obtained from natural sources is quite expensive, whereas, whereas clothes made by acrylic are relati uh, relatively cheap. Please improve your reading better. Start practicing at home. Okay? Mariam? Yes, ma'am. Start practicing at home better. So during winter, what we wear with us? Sweaters, shawls, and we get into the blankets, right? Now, generally they are from natural wool, we know that. 
yes but these days they look like natural wool but they don't they are not they look, resemble wool but they are not so what are they they are acrylic so they are prepared from another synthetic fiber called acrylic why are we using acrylic because the wool that we use for making sweater shawls they are quite expensive and that's the reason why people go for the shawls and the sweaters and the clothes made from acrylic why because they are very cheap as compared to wool they are cheap understood understood beta yes ma'am yes ma'am ma'am can i okay tania no fiza fiza oh sir they are available in a variety of colors synthetic fibers are more durable and affordable which makes them more popular than natural natural fibers okay well done good good now these are present in so many different colors they are long lasting what is durable beta what is durable long lasting they may die but they will sleep they will stay and they are quite affordable that means they can be bought by any of us so it becomes popular as simple as that in the market it is popular as compared to natural fibers and the subject you can see the colors yes beta Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. The more of polyester. Ma'am, can I read Owen Fatima? Ma'am, can I, I read? Wish that, I wish that others will also take part. So I want all of you to take part. Ma'am, can I read Owen Fatima? Fatima. Fatima. Fatima Rajan. Owen Fatima, can I read, ma'am? So you only read it, no? Owen Fatima. Hello. Ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Uh, so that's why I answer. If they don't read, then you take up. But let's allow all of them to take part. Okay, ma'am. You are always there. Okay, you are always there. I will ask you. Don't worry. But I wish that others also take part. Yes, who will want to read? Ma'am, can I read Sabki Narayan? Okay, start reading with me. Start. Polyester, alcohol, and organic acid came together to make compounds called esters, which are polymer. Polyester come under the brand names of silicon, tetracron, cerimon, and decron. Cerimon and polyester. Terrilin, Dacron, Terril, and Polyester. Read it again. Terrilin, Dacron, Terril, and Polyester. Be a bit louder, Rita. Don't be scared. Open your mouth and speak up. Is it clear? Okay. Sakina. Yes, Rita. Are you are you there? Can you hear me? Yes. So polyester is made up of alcohol and organic acid. So they are reacted in a research laboratory so that they, we get certain compounds which is on the esters and they are polymers that we already know. The polyesters that you get in the market. Comes under the brand names of Terrilin, Decron, Terrine, and Polyester. Is that understandable? Yes. This you have to mug up. Okay. See over here properties of polyester. What is there, brother? Properties of polyester. 
first one leaf litter is oven patamba yes ma'am resistance and resistance to pests and chemicals it's not pests it is pest resistance to pests and chemicals that means pests and chemicals that means this is a property of polyester that means nothing harms the polyester pests cannot make any hole in it chemicals cannot work on acrylic so it is free what is this dries quickly what is this is it why does not i said sometimes you have seen cotton please so cotton it shrinks yes ma'am yes this thing does not happen with polyester next the permanent crease is heated and pressed so if if you are ironing it up after wash also the crease will be the same the crease don't change after washing it you understand so once yes, you are ironing it it remains so after wash as well next that light weight and elastic it is very tough that is strong but is light weight and you can pull it you put a high tensile stress it is elastic so i hope you understood the properties of polyester as well yes ma'am okay. now we'll see uses of polyester yes we will do making magnetic audio and video cassettes and floppy disks so we make audio video cassettes and floppy disks by using this polyester so the cassettes that you see is of made up of polyester remember that next highly suitable for fitting fitting sarees and jack draperies shirting suiting sarees and draperies so here we are using for those um, fashion wears of uh, suiting and shirts then for sarees also and draperies draperies are for the curtains and for the furniture that's for us draperies Mixed with fiberglass for molding it into helmets, protective sheets, and fulls in boots. Now, this polyester fiberglass for making helmets and also sheets for giving protection to any object and hulls in boots. What are hulls, Peter? now this is the board this is the board right yes yes this is the board this portion is called hull okay hull is the bottom portion which is inside the water that is called as hull and uh, this is given this is made up of wood i think you know that this is made up of wood so they make a protective sheet around that hull so that there will be no accident because remember the boats break from the hull only the water gets inside yes ma'am and the boat capsizes the boat drowns so as not to happen it is given strength by giving a protective sheet around the hull okay beta by the force okay ma'am now we come to acrylic revision then i get i need to 
I'll click. I'll click is often used as a sub substitute of for wool. I'll click fibers are strong and wrinkle resistant. It is easy to wash and dries quickly. It is it is resistance to moth oils, chemicals and that that radiation on exposed to sunlight. Exposure. Exposure to sunlight. Now acrylic we can use instead of wool. So it's a substitute. So I will not use wool, I will use acrylic. You understand? Yes ma'am. That's for yes, ma'am. Second. Very strong. And the best part we, we learned just now that it is wrinkle free. Nothing happens to the to the clothing. Very easy to wash and it dries quickly. So these are all advantages of that. Another advantage is that moths and other pests cannot harm this. Press materials, whatever is made up of acrylic, no, no, no harm is done by moth or oil or chemicals. And even, for example, you must have observed again that when mama is putting it, uh, the clothes on the clothesline, and if the sunlight is very intense, repeat, if the sunlight is very intense, then you can see a line in between. The one which is towards the sun has faded. And the one is which is away from the sun remains from the sun remains the same. Am I right? Yes. Ma Have you ever observed that two halves? If you put the clothesline, the the cloth on the clothesline, the one which is towards the sun has faded as compared. You can see the discoloration. The half portion will be lighter than the other half. Have you observed any time? Especially the bright colors, you can make a difference. Okay, Vita? Hello? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma